Machining the Orthotic is the third video in a three-part series called Making Foot Orthotics created by Delcam and Freedom Machine Tool. Let's join Bill Oberg with Freedom Machine Tool to learn about machining the foot orthotics on the Patriot OrthoRoute CNC router. And now we're going to handle it over to Bill Oberg at or OrthoRoute. Thank you, Tiago. I'd like to take a minute if you move up here with me and let's just uh, talk about the machine tool real quick. Uh, this is a Patriot Ortho Route 4x2, so it's got a 4x2 foot table. We've got a 5 horsepower automatic tool change spindle, so we can pick from a selection of tools here through our process automatically. This has a 5 position tool rack, so we can pick from 5 tools, and it also has an auto tool height sensor uh, for setting our, our Z zeros. Um, also on this machine, of course, we have the flip fixture, which is designed for machining the hard plastic uh, orthotics. Um, and we have that mounted onto a matrix table, which is set up with vacuum for doing EVA and other materials. So, machining EVA, of course, we need vacuum to hold down the material. And I think what I'll do, if you don't mind, Tiago, I'm just going to show the vacuum system here real quick. If you come close on the table here, you can see that we've got vacuum points and you can see gasketing in the table. Uh, back here in this crate, and it's not real easy to see, we have a five horsepower vacuum pump, which I'm going to turn on right now. With the vacuum pump on, I can pull these various ports open. These are just little plugs that we've designed that pop out and when I turn on the vacuum handle, we get vacuum. So when I put down my EVA material and turn on the vacuum, we're down hard on the table for cutting EVA material. So we've really got a what we call our ortho, ortho table system here, which is designed and set up for cutting EVA material, for cutting hard plastics material. We can cut MDF and LDF, and also foam materials, six pound density foams, etc., for cutting foot positives and whatnot. So a real complete system here. Okay, so we saw the EVA set up, so we've got vacuum, we can hold down parts of the table. Now we're gonna set up the hard plastic for machining your arch support that we designed just for you. So we took Tiago, we took a scan of his foot, we went through uh, ortho model, we went through ortho mill, and then finally we have a file now on this USB stick that goes into the machine to machine the hard plastic arch support. So I'll walk over here to the control. put in the USB stick, and then I can go to my utilities sc screen, my Explorer, and I can go select this file, which is 211Tiago. I've already copied the file, but I just wanted you to see the process. We can use a USB stick to transfer files, or we can actually put this on a, on a network through a standard Ethernet connection. Okay, so now we're ready to load our plastic blank. We can cut polyethylene, we can cut polypropylene, really all the plastic materials and foam materials. This is inch and a quarter uh, polypropylene here, and this loads right into our fixture. So we center it up pretty good here, and we just kind of line them up so we're nice in the center of the fixture. Good in the front, top to bottom, and then we tighten down. With the Allen wrench, just to a nice finger tight.
and now the material is loaded and as you can see I can flip the fixture and the material is not going to move. So what we want to do and what's important, in, important is that we're going to machine uh, the top side of the part, flip it over, machine the bottom side. We have to stay very accurate so we can't let the material move again and that's what's special and perfect about this fixture design. Now when we're ready to machine, we clamp the handles and we're ready to start our program. And finally we go over to the control, we select our program and we start. I go to the main menu, I go to execute, I select Tiago, that's program 211 as you saw uh, previously, I hit enter, set my feed rate, and cycle start. Now first you're going to see a tool change in the machine. So we were running something earlier and we needed to change back to our number one tool. So there is the automatic tool changer in process.
will change. And we're going to leave the final tabs for the part. little tabs left there and at this point it's beautiful we can just pop this part right out of the material by design so this is an arch support now that's ready to be finished a little bit of touch-up finishing on the edge material on the top and that's why we use a coarser finish here on the top is because the material and the adhesive sticks better to the top surface what? with a coarser what? finish so that is the complete process for scanning a foot modeling the orthotic, outputting the CNC code, coming to the Freedom Machine tool, and cutting. And of course, in our block, we could have set up and nested up to four pair, or four and a half pair, of hard plastic orthotics in this sheet. The material is about $25 a blank, so it works out to about $6 and change per pair. And the cycle time for a full sheet is approximately 28 minutes for 4.5 pairs of the hard plastic arch supports. So again, about uh, six, seven minutes for each pair. The strength of the, of the Freedom Machine Tool, the steel design, all steel, uh, one piece base, stress relief, AC servo motors, uh, large profile rails are what make machining hard plastic arch supports real possible and a great process. This machine has the integrity uh, for this process as you can see from the video. So that is a wrap. That was Delcam Software and Freedom Machine Tool bringing you this arch support. Thanks for your time. To learn more about the Patriot Ortho Route CNC router by Freedom Machine Tool, please call Bill Oberg at 207-704-0029. Thanks for watching.